from so long time it's three hours. What do you want to say about for the delay? Oh, um, I am very thankful for your patience. Um, there was just an avoidable circumstance that came up. So I'm very grateful for your patience, guys. So uh, welcome to our channel. And uh, ma'am, what do you want to say about the winning movement? Uh, tell us about that and uh, tell us about your movement on the stage. Um, when the host was about to announce the, the winner, I was, I was um, a bit uh, feeling nervous, but at the same time excited because I had always felt from the very beginning that I would never want to lose the competition. <laughs> so it, it deep in my heart, I was already a winner. And, and uh, who inspired you to uh, come so far uh, in the journey? Um, I was inspired by my director, Aida Patana, and I was also inspired by many sister beauty queens back in my country, because as you all know that Philippines has been producing a lot of beauty queens across the globe. So, I was inspired by them. Thank you. Right, and tell us about your journey from start and finally you got the crown. So, how, how was the journey? Um, the journey about this uh, pageantry. Actually, yeah, w way back in 1997, I was crowned as the queen of my place back in Cebu, Philippines, particularly in my municipality. And after that, I was focusing on my motherhood and my um, uh, some colleges and my businesses. And then I have been very passionate about uh, beauty queens, pageantry. In fact, I dream of having a baby girl. Unfortunately, <laughs> no lucky, but I have on five. Uh, sons, but hopefully in the near future I have because I have one granddaughter, so hopefully. So my journey has uh, not been smooth since um, the notice to, to represent my country was very short. Um, it was only barely like um, two months. Obviously, that is not um, enough time to prepare, especially uh, being focused on businesses. But I enjoyed at the same time and excited to come back here in India because I was here already before for almost three months in Chennai. So regardless, I was not ready Physically, but emotionally and mentally, I was more than ready to serve my reign right. as a queen. And how was your experience in India? Have you enjoyed in India? Actually, um, the f the f uh, we had a, a long journey, although it took only like seven to eight hours to come here. It, I knew that from before, but since the few flights and the late flights, it took us very long time to get here. That made us um, uh, knocked, and the, the in few hours we had to to get ready for the first day of L, um, preliminary competition. But we were enjoying and. Again, I was very happy to taste again the, the Indian cuisines. Uh, also, you got the award from Bollywood uh, personality. What do you want to say about it? And uh, how, how was that moment? Like, you got the crown also and you got the award also. Tell us about that. 
Um, uh, I was, uh, I was, uh, can I ask again the question? You, you got the crown also and you got the award from Bollywood personality. What do you want to say? <laughs> oh, yeah. It was very amazing and very great feeling to be able to, to finally won the crown. And because first it was only a, a dream and an imagination, and finally I got this, and it, 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 gave, it gives the life of my dream. And I'm very grateful and honored for India, especially the team of Sir Mohammed and his company for giving me an opportunity through my our national director Aida Patana to join this competition and to be able to come back here in India and so honored to to receive such a very uh, prestigious award I never thought I would I was I was that deserve to receive such a uh, well known Award. Were you nervous before uh, participating in this pageant? Because it's an international icon pageant. What do you want to say about that? Were you nervous and what preparation you have gone through for this pageant? Um, the preparation was, um, we didn't find it hard since the owner of the pageantry has been very good uh, providing us a very good help and guidance as we prepared back in Philippines and also my friend our national director she gave me a lot of suppliers from from my outfits and also I have a very excellent team for the Q and a question and answer and they how to post on stage since it had been a long time since I last joined the pageantry. So it was only uh, to wrap it up, it's, it's smooth. And, and lastly ma'am, uh, what is next, like any of your upcoming projects after this, what, what is your plan for future after this? Um, to, to make my reign meaningful since I know it is only uh, 12 months and time is very short so I was planning of course to to continue my advocacy back in the Philippines I submitted my advocacy to the um, um, management of this pageantry I showed them what I do in Philippines to the underprivileged women children and to those who are brilliant who have brilliant minds but underprivileged students for law college of law so i'm supporting filipino people to become to uh, filipino people who have aspirations to become lawyers so i i i supported them because i wanted to be part of the resolutions of the oppressed people. So also I was thinking to come back here in India and do some charity, charitable activities. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you so much and all the best. Man. You are most welcome. Thank you also for your patience. Thank you. Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you. So Sheila, we wanted to know from you, you won a pageant. What do you want to say about it? It's the biggest uh, India's pageant. Yeah. Uh, how do you feel and what do you want to say about um, as a, oh yeah. <laughs> okay, as a first timer, like joining in a pageant and it's very it's very I'm so grateful and honored to be part of this pageant because it is a international and it's also my first time and I'm really happy about it. And well, how was your experience? My experience was so fun and I got nervous but it's all worth it. And, and tell us about your journey, how, how, how you started and finally you got the crowd and um, tell us about your journey. I started with my training in Philippines 
because we train there like it's very difficult because it's not really easy as a first time like first time joining in a pageant so it's so it's so like nervous and but when I got the crown I feel so happy and honored what do you want to say about Indian fans who are uh, so proud of you um, I'm very I'm very happy to my Indian fans because they're so hospitable people and they're so friendly and I love them so much because they, they have like a good attitude to me. And who inspires you as an actor and model? Um, I inspired by my mother, Aida Patana, because she's working hard as a person, like a single mother, raising her five kids and I really love about her. Shivangi Joshi, she's the biggest Indian actress, and she gave you the award. What do you want to say about it? You you got the crown, and you got the award also. So yeah, I feel so I feel so lucky because the actress is handing me the crown, and I feel so humble and lucky to have. And what is next? Uh, any of your upcoming project, or what? what what are you planning for the future? Uh, for the future, I'm planning to um, donate some of like a good cans in Philippines, which uh, those are in need in there. But and I feel so lucky to it. So. <laughs> it's a very great experience with this iconic awards which I have gained. And thanks for Mr. Mohammad Lagman Latif to bring me here to stand here and speak with you guys. It's uh, I really thankful to him. I uh, as pleasure with this runner up, and the experience was really great with him. And uh, tell us about that moment you you got the crown and uh, you felt it uh, with the award. <laughs> I was so happy with this uh, because this is the, my first season show with him, even the iconic award with uh, this is the first season I have did with this. So I feeling so good with uh, and the guys are so good. They are like so lovable with us and I really love them. Thank you. Right. Also, Sheila wanted to know from you, finally you got the crown. Any plans to work in Bollywood and who inspires you in the Bollywood? Any actor you like? Any favorite actor you, you want to talk about? Um, about the actress, I don't really know uh, what's the, who's the actress, but I'm very um, open-minded. I'm willing to accept what the opportunity will take me, so I'm very happy about it. Uh, if I'll get a chance to go. If I'll get a chance to go in Bollywood, so I will definitely go with them because I, we know that it's a very big platform for us to go in to enter the Bollywood. So I really would hope for this if I'll get a chance to go with them. Thanks. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I, I haven't planned for any of this for future, but I will I will be looking for that if I'll get and so many fans are uh, inspired by you. So any message you'd like to give to them? Um, to all my Philippines fans, I'm so grateful to have of you guys because you're giving us full support and I'm really happy about it and I feel so lucky. Thank you. Thank you so much, both of you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let's do a vision this pageant. Uh, it's the uh, world's biggest uh, uh, beauty pageant and what do you want to say about it? Um, it was very unexpected and I was very happy to bring the crown to the Philippines and and all I can say is I'm willing to do more and um, bring more to the Philippines. Tell us about that moment when you when you were awarded with crown and um, I really thought that I wasn't gonna win because I had very big competitors and when they called my name to, to be the winner and I was really shocked and it was very happy, a very happy moment for me. And tell us about your journey, how, how you started and finally you got the crown. Um, I, re I really had a short time to prepare because um, this was uh, unexpected that I would join. And it, it, I had two weeks to prepare for this a pageant and it was very tiring and it was very tiring and a very 
big learning for me and it was very uh, happy experience yeah. so any any plan to come into bollywood because you got the crown from bollywood itself and soon after i finish my um things to do in the philippines i, I i'd be happy to come and do bollywood in in india who inspired you who like who, who do you like in the bollywood actor actress um to be honest i don't know any bollywood actresses or actors right now okay so any any message for fans who are watching this video um thank you so much for supporting me and coming with me through this journey and i hope that you'll continue to support me whatever um things i do in the future thank you thank, thank you so you. much and all the best